So the shit that went on at Nancy Pelosi's house with Paul Pelosi and uh, that guy, apparently, you know, Paul Pelosi didn't do nothing illegal. Um, the son of that guy saying that uh, he was not Democrat or Republican, he didn't like either one of them. He lived on, he lived on a compound with hippies and BLM and Black Lives Matter. Uh, we know this already. You know, um, what I'm getting at, though, is that nobody like if if you're if you're into some kind of dungeon fucking sadist, whatever shit, I get it. Like a lot of normal people are a little bit uh, into domination. Um, it's normal. Like it's almost kind of normal. Uh, it's not illegal. And would you want your partner to go to Leavenworth for coming over to, when you called them to do something uh, a little bit uh, S and M? Like the the point is that you're supposed to want to dominate them a little bit, tie them up a little bit, whip them a little bit, but you don't want to fucking roll them into a dungeon and say okay good night i mean i heard that you had to be a little bit careful with some of the people because you have to come up with safe words and then there are some people that are going to exploit so it's better to have a spouse or somebody that you cared about if you're going to do that okay now it's not illegal now the dude don't got to go to leavenworth because you know what i mean if he was trying to escape if he was trying to leave and he was hindered from leaving because of the way it looked. And then even though it's not illegal, they still got to sacrifice this dude to fucking Leavenworth prison. Is it them or is it somebody telling them that they're not allowed to have any. Do you know how many people um, Nancy Pelosi fucked? She was a fucking. Um, like, uh, no, see, Barbara Walters, okay? Like, fucking is part of their mystique. It is part of their mystique. But what their husband, though, when you get old, can't expect, I can't expect him to even not be, like, it's funny, like, somebody in prison, like, they start fucking around with that gay shit. I don't know if everybody... You know what I mean? Some people are going to not be able to go without some kind of sexual contact. Some people can shut it off and be like, okay, well, that's not happening anymore. Right? But some people can't. So, is but this is it like, okay. So I know people are saying the crime, the crime part is that the hammer, okay? You swung a hammer, that's illegal. You know what I mean? And and uh, they're never gonna begrudge that this guy might have been trying to get away because when uh, at first uh, the police arrived, Pelosi was not trying to be discovered. He might have still had some some black pet patent leather. Might have had some leather on. I'm like, why are you wearing leather pants, boy? Nobody's supposed to care about that shit, but these people are too big to fail. So now some fucking stupid uh, little side thing that he got going on that nobody gives a fuck about that anybody within legal, like, it's, it's not even illegal. But not only do we got to care about this shit, but when whatever you say about it. It's just going to be like a, a wall. Like, no, no, I can't do this. I can't believe that this is going to happen. I just can't. No, no, no. What? What is the crime? That he's a little bit weird and a little bit fruity or a little bit sugar. Like, what the fuck? I don't care enough for them to get afford so much fucking uh, um, damage control. You know what I mean? And then I don't feel a way about the guy that they want to fuck that is 
um, that everybody needs for him to be to, in order to throw his ass in, in the claim forever, in the clink for forever because you, you, you're not getting out bro like you know who that was do you know who that was you know what i mean we do not release people like you're gonna do every minute of that fucking fed time because people have to understand that you cannot touch the wrong motherfucker some people cannot be touched in a bar you don't know who you're talking to you know what i mean if you want to act tough and emasculate and you said, you, me, outside right now. And you don't know whose son or daughter that is. You're not going to make it. That's your last day free. That's your last day free in a life. Both of them. You could be one or the other, but you can't have both. For, ne for nothing. It seemed like nothing, right? It's, it's, it's fucking on steroids. It's on steroids. And if you're an Ethiopian motorist... And you try to cut around another car that slowed down on the freeway and you accidentally hit somebody who shouldn't be on the freeway that was wearing all black at night. Fuck you. White supremacy. And not not because you not because the majority of people walking around thinks this either. It's because they haven't fucking uh, busted all this down yet. They're on surface level. And the, the PR is trying to keep things under control on that surface level until they hear one more thing and then one more thing and then ask one person who, by way of not hearing about it, has to look up something or wants to talk about something what they know instead of looking stupid, talking about what they don't know. Then they got to stop repeating so-and-so's line and maybe looking more seriously at somebody else's line. But you know what it's not going to be is my mom. Uh, um, she maybe loves the maybe she loves her son, maybe she loves the crap out of me. But she is controlled, and uh, she's she's like everything she's doing is out of love. You know what I mean? She lies to me out of love. She gaslights me out of love. She does all this shit to me out of love. Like uh, the gaslighting and. And deception. She can't show me no recognition for any effort and upfront in person, but tells everybody else great things about me, and then I never hear anything about myself that's good. But if somebody else, like uh, uh, you know, I tried to poison my my ears or something like that. You know what I mean? Like she would, she would convict them on a jury. She would throw away the. You would, she would, you would get like, she would uh, ha, put t a, a green light on somebody. And she, you know what I mean? She, would, she might set up a hit. You know what I mean? But nothing in life can she do for me that's anything beneficial. But she might whack a motherfucker though. For, for trying, you know, like. <clears throat> for trying to imply that I did something legal that isn't even illegal. Covering up. It's like if this is a serial killer. If I was a serial killer, whoever it is I'm serial killing, they got it coming to them. If you ask my mom. But ask her about, ask her about the dude that uh, was in Nancy Pelosi. Oh, oh yeah. These is... These guys are racist. This is. They, they gotta go. These people, they, like, they, she will just tell you exactly what whatever mainstream shit is being. She can't do really help me with no perspective at all. And and if somebody has to go to jail for a false narrative, she will sit on them like eggs hatch, like a like a chicken on the eggs. So just sit on its exculpatory evidence. So just keeping them warm, you know what I mean? So these little uh, monstrous lies can hatch, you know what I mean? I think of it as like the eggs are like deceptions. They, when the truth, if a truth comes out that is, con and before anybody else and it's controversial, you know what I mean? Those are the people that are going to want to, uh, like a PR firm, they're gonna want to uh, 
cater and condition the narrative and you know what I mean buy up any footage like TMZ bought all the footage of takeoff being killed and then placed the the everything made every, altered all the footage and made everything unbelievable and now nobody can believe anything they've seen because there's something contradictory uh going on like uh jay prince basically can fly around uh, uh downstairs and around crowds and in, in one second and be in two places in two different at one different at one time in two different seconds but and showing up on footage and what like it's, it's like nobody can say anything that they've seen is real and then some people are going to react uh, and commit more crimes based on what they think is true before they come out and the police before they come out and tell you what what's really going on because they're they they're they can't tell people their investigation so it's like uh it's not their fault it's not their fault it's tmz's fault it's not the police's fault because they're not supposed to fuck up their investigation it's tmz's fault for getting pro for pro proprietary uh, footage and what they did, what they do with it, and it's just a, a it's just a little hustle. But other people, you know, they might fly off the handle and react or respond to something, kill somebody. Now you got a whole nother crimes to work out, and when due time, when we get around to them. But that's the entertainment industry does for a, a community. That's what they do for our community. They get some of us to kill some of the other of us before the dust settles from a previous investigation or are still trying to figure shit out. I don't know, you can get mad. I don't know, it's just like, you know, some escapism. Like, if you can't understand how it's escapism, I, I can understand, I can understand it because it's a little abstract. How is J Jacobianism escapism? How is Opus Day? How is that escapism? This motherfucking flogging himself. But it's escape. It's a form of escapism because the 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 mind is or the the soul is a monster. It is a monstrous. Uh, and his soul is a good thing. Keep it definitely one that improvise with soul and music and art and everything you do but uh it's a, it's like it can be like a like a molecule if you change one little uh atom around combination in the molecule the break a bond and it'll be a radically different molecule even with the slightly variation it'll be radically different right it's like folding magnets over or something like that uh to get them to commit to uh, folding over a, a seventh time or something like that, the motherfucking magnets will just blow up. Because it's enough force to have to be able to put a crease in the whole universe. Uh, right there on the micro, micro cosm too. And the universe is not to scale, but there is macro and micro. Some things are macro and micro uh, cosmic. All right, let me get off of here.